Hey, welcome to Sakura Wars 5. I already hate it. I told you we were doing this. I told you. We I told you. We version's better. <clears throat> Why? Because we're... Uh, let's see. Um, it's better in English. Uh, let's see. Um, oh, wow. Look, a schoolgirl. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see. Wow, I bet you can't tell what gender that person is. That's a trope there. Oh, look, a bird. A bird Birds lady. Suck. <laughs> a city? Oh. A city. Fuck that. All anime takes place in cities. Cities suck. Oh, wow, this looks about as dated as Tenchi. No wonder you like it. <laughs> <laughs> Although, I should mention that this uh, the the artist is done by Kosuke Fujishima. Isn't who, that a Tails guy? Yeah, he's a Tails guy. He's one of my favorite uh, mangaka. Okay. My favorite artists. I love his character design. Looks good. It's kind of weird, though, that he's, like, in his, like, early 60s, and he married a 20-year-old. Oh, great. I <laughs> Fucking, do I really have to be fun? Oh, wow, this is a mecha. Yeah, it's a mech. It's a mech shit. Oh, yeah. Oh, 1920s steampunk mech anime goodness. Cool, I get to mark another thing off of it. So, uh, the reason why we're doing this is because... We did a really, really terrible moment in <laughs> Ultra Despair Girls, our other series, on the sister <laughs> channel, uh, the Niskel LP, and I was so completely flabbergasted at how terrible it was that I forced him to do this. And is it going to be good? Is it going to be bad? I don't know. We're going to find out, though. Uh, yeah. We'll find out. I think, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Postex, but I think for some un unknown reason, the Wii box art and the PS2 box art are completely different. I don't think they are. I could have sworn they were. Or maybe I'm just losing my mind. You're losing your mind. Time to gain it back in the Little Lip Theater for Sakura Wars. So long, my love. Great. So we're starting out with lip service. Yeah. <laughs> it's already terrible. <laughs> it's all bad. Yeah, here it is. Sakura Wars 5. It's, it's, it's going to be fun. So, uh... What the hell is this? The free and easy day in New York is pretty much where you go around and look at bonus stuff. Oh, okay. Better for towards the end of the game. See, so attack speed, uh, fast... Go fast. Stereo voice on vibration. Yeah, turn on. Oh, sure. Not. Cam and uh, oh, Camertron ringtone. Oh, so, Earth Warriors is yeah. the obvious choice there. Um, you know what? Just, just in case. Fine. It'll all make sense. T I, I hope so. We're, we're playing the Japanese version because I just think it's this is superior version. Mm -hmm. Because you would. Because I would. Hey, it's my channel, my show, my rules! Exactly. So, uh, the Nisko's actually playing this game, because uh -huh. I want him to, you know, he hasn't played this before, and it's right. going to be a first new experience for him. And I'm going to be following along with the guide to make sure he makes the right choices. Or maybe the wrong ones. <laughs> this is our player character. Oh, imagine that. Teenage boy with no mom. I think his mom's still alive. Well, she's at least somewhere else. But uh, he's in Japan. He's going to go to New York to be part of the army or whatever. Oh, he's a foreign exchange student? <laughs> that's that's a character from all the other Sakura Wars. This is actually the fifth Sakura Wars game, and this is the only Sakura Wars game to be released in the U.S. Because it takes place in the U.S., and it deals with entirely new characters. Oh, so it's a war for her. No, she's only in this for like this opening bit. <laughs> we are Lieutenant Shinjiro Taiga! Oh, God, for some, this reminds me of time in eternity. That's not good. <laughs> Don't worry, this is way better than eternity. <laughs> this actually has some artistic integrity behind it. Does this have a talking dragon, therefore worse? Uh, no. It does not have a talking dragon. Does it have a split personality waifu? I don't think so. Yes, actually. God damn it. <laughs> you, can t you can take as much of the piss out of this as you want. Then. I'm, I'm welcome for that. I take the piss out of Dagerup all the time. I think it's only fair you do it for this one. But maybe there won't be any piss to take out of because you might like it yourself. Who knows? Uh, sure, I'll play it's not that hard. It's a fucking anime game. It'd be better than fucking... I, 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 I mean, I could just point at the blocks and go... <laughs> and there we go, that's it. <laughs> that's the joke! <laughs> thanks, for, thanks for watching, ladies and gentlemen! Hey, look, an anime game! I bet these guys have a lot of integrity. So, to tie the rest of the series continuity, uh... Yeah, what happened? Our uncle... Yeah. 
is the main character of the other four Sakura Wars games. Uh huh. We are in yeah, yeah, we're still in Japan, but the other games like take place in like, France, London, and stuff like that. So that goes all around the world. Sure, sure. So, Commander Ogami is our uncle. The guy sitting at the desk there. Oh man, it's been a while since I played a PS2 game. Yeah, I know, dude. Ooh, those textures. Ah! Hi. He has a lot of seashells. That's my uncle? It's your uncle. Is he like three years older than me? Probably. <laughs> well, he might be a bit older. Like, like oh, 20s. Here, here, count the rings in his ears. You can see how okay, old he is. Okay, you gotta choose, gotta choose. What are you gonna say? Oh. You have a limited amount of time to make choices. Ah. The other reason why I'm bringing you on board because you gotta really think quickly about your decisions because there's uh, a lot of you know, this is also a strategy game, like, you know, a mm -hmm. strategy RPG or whatever. Yeah, yeah. And a lot of the strength of your comrades have to do with how much they like you and each other. All right. So you got to make the right choices to make sure that, you know, the, the relationship between you deepens, and that's how you get stronger, and that's how the game becomes easier. Okay. Now, let me ask you this. Sure. Are we going to do split timeline shit and show off the bad stuff and the good stuff? Nah, it's going to be all one playthrough. All right. Because maybe it can convince everybody else to go out and pick up the game themselves! Yeah, be sure to get the Wii version so you can have options. You don't have options in the Wii version. Yeah, I thought you did. You only have the English version in the Wii version. Oh, then yeah, choose that one because it's obviously better. <laughs> <laughs> this is my show! Nihongo <laughs> <laughs> Dakina! Yeah, Nihongo Dakina Bow in here, yeah, too. <laughs> this is good. I always got a thing for, uh, you know, it's kind of motion of anime. Because you know? ever since anime and video games have been a thing, they've tried to make anime into video games. 19! <laughs> That's another one off the list, right? <laughs> Slightly older than a high schooler, fuck it! Old enough to be out of high school, but not young enough to be an adult. 19, so a teenager. How old was, uh, Intara Okabe? Is he like, he was like in early 20s. Right? I think he's like very early 20s. 20, I think? Okay. And he's fine. I mean, he goes out and drinks his time to get zero, so... Okay, yeah, so at least 21. Where's my Christine? Oh, wait, no, we got a cutscene. We got a cutscene. It's a lovely animated cutscene. Oh. This is my favorite part of the Persona games. You told me to protect my sack. Is this what you meant? I'm not going to to Oh, one more thing. Just believe in yourself. You know, don't think too hard about it. Just go for it. Don't oh, believe in yourself. That's something that happens in Naruto. Therefore, point off. Oh, therefore, crap. Garbage. Oh my god, he is the Statue of Liberty! Give me your tired, your poor, your weeaboos. <laughs> damn it! Beat me to it! Yeah! God damn it! <laughs> I was gonna say... Weebs, but I like your weebs there. Hi, I'm from Nihon. Where's your, uh, where's your waifu's at? Funnily enough, because we're playing a Japanese version, it's kind of weird to see a New York version where everybody speaks Japanese. <laughs> oh, that is weird. I don't think Love Live even did that when they went to America. Yeah, you can just do it. Also, for some reason, they changed the name of one of the characters in the English version for no discernible reason. No region, huh? Reason. Sajita Weinberg is somehow replaced as Karen Archer. I mean, did you hear what you just said? Yeah, I heard Japanese. Sajita, what's, what's weird about it? I don't know. I'm just saying. A lot of English speakers and a lot of people who love to play this game trip over themselves the entire time when trying to say that name. Not saying that's why they changed it. Uh, chapter one! A samurai makes his first stand! Oh, so we beat the prologue. That was a great first episode. See you next <laughs> time. All right, all right. <laughs> what, a ten minute episode? What is this, Game Corps? <laughs> that was, uh, that was one, a dig, two, a joke, and three, awesome. Hey, look! Planet Nuts. <laughs> I love it already. <laughs> that's, that's, that's Planter Nuts, actually. Oh, it is? Oh, wait, there is a sticker over it. Damn it. Kya thief. Thief in the middle of the day? Ah. At this time of year, in the middle of the day. <laughs> Good lord! <laughs> oh, no. 
Oh wow. If they are they are definitely thieves. What the hell? Fucking samurai cowboy. What's wrong with that? In America? Yeah, man. That's believable. There's actually a prologue game again like released in Japan that's just about her. Living in Texas with her master. To become a samurai. Precisely. In America. Yeah. On horseback. <laughs> she taught her horse to kick money. Here, take that one bag. I'll take it with you. Uh, What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? What do you think? <laughs> What's it to you? Why do you have a mask on? I don't know what that means. I've never had a sack of money before. I mean, I'm from Japan. We're always poor over here. Oh, yeah. She's not making a lot of sense. Alright, later. Goodbye, tuxedo mask. <laughs> I'll miss you. That was a man. Oh, wow. Yeah, he did it. Who's that red-haired guy from Yu Yu Hakusho? One with a rose whip. Uh, oh. Uh... Shit. Damn it. Karama. Yeah! Karama. Let's try about Kuwabara. <laughs> no, Do a Shinjiro Tiger! No, because I would have... bring back that second money! <laughs> no, no, I would have done the voice if it was Kuwabara. <laughs> hey, boy. <laughs> hey, boy. Boy. Oh, great. <laughs> so we can't wrestle. No, th doesn't this happen every week? You go to America, you you, know, you witness a bank heist, you get the money, and you're about to take it back, but then, of course, American officials come over and they arrest you just because you're Please. foreign. Yeah, you're a minority, so of course you're bound to get arrested. <laughs> I mean, just imagine if my skin tone wasn't white. It was anything but. <laughs> Wow, game over already! What? Time for another anime trope, some guy with a guitar. So this is old-fashioned anime. Yeah, this is, like, from the old Cause days, I'm, I'm getting, man. I'm getting Trigun vibes, this is awesome. I think this game, I think this game was actually made in, like, 2005. Nice Kayama. Kayama Yuichi. Us Japanese folks gotta stick together, I guess. He doesn't serve much purpose. I mean, he's getting me off the hook. Isn't that good enough? I wanted to arrest the Japanese kid! This guy's a crib, I can't remember. So I'll arrest you too. That's seriously all he has to do is put the one half of the handcuffs that isn't on me, put it on him. And he's like, come on, guys. Then it'll be Sakura Wars to insanity. You ever played that Crash game before? Yes, no, I think that's the one where uh, you play the game with your handcuffed to insane or whatever. Anyway, this is the Lip Theater. This is where we're going to be working now. Long lip. That's a big lip! Ain't no little lip about that. Welcome to my gentleman's club, Kaiosuchi san. It's a theater. Like a theater, theater, not like, you know, a sexy broth or like a burlesque house. Right? Yeah, like a theater. It's, it, it, it is a theater. They, they put on shows here. Cool. All kinds of backgrounds come here to have fun. It's, it, it's a theater, okay? It's a theater. Yeah, it's a theater. It is a theater. I'm not accusing you of anything otherwise. No, it's, it's, it's rated T, goddammit. Because the exact moment that it's not a theater, I'm going to mark another thing off the list, you <laughs> weep fuck. <laughs> Up, girl. I think she's from a previous Sakura Wars. Game. Hi, are you from Prequel Land? <laughs> lieutenant. I'm a lieutenant that's already been arrested in America. Welcome. They were sending, you know, the other guy, the real hero. <laughs> Yeah, my uncle's too old and fat, so he sent me. This is Ratchet Altair. <laughs> what a name! Maybe Altair. I'm gonna go with Altair. <laughs> Sup, Miss Ratchet? A woman? 
Is my boss? Making difficult assumptions. I'm very pleased to meet you. Oh, damn it, I didn't read fast enough to hit option one. I just want to ruin everything. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like that was the right yeah, answer. Yeah, so good choice, it. so well, well done. It was actually a very good choice. I've played these games before. So, <laughs> Oh, I remember this Ratchet moment in Persona 5. I'm gonna take this casino down. Well, they didn't invent the metaverse until uh, 1962. Damn it! So it would, it would be here by now. Unless this is like way early. How, how old is this? 1920. Damn it! Okay. That's why he was so excited at seeing the Statue of Liberty. If this took place in modern day, he'd be like, Oh, fuck! <laughs> you know, if this took place in modern day, everybody would have been dead by now. It's either that or they would all have knee-high socks. Because <laughs> 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 I guarantee you, if they made a sequel to this nowadays, that would be the only thing you'd see is short skirts and knee-high socks. I hope not, because sounds like Sig is going to be making another soccer Awards. By popular demand. Somebody's gonna fall. Oh, Hot Spring, mark that off the list. Fuck it. It's terrible. I better see some blushing by the end of this episode. Well, you're gonna be a gentleman and not peek. You're gonna look. I'm gonna be a fucking trash monkey. I don't know about you. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good thing I already beat this game twice. <laughs> I did one run with uh, one girl and I did run one with another girl. Oh, okay. Because there are multiple endings to this, and that depends on. Who is your top oh, lady by uh, What's up, Poindexter? Konnichiwa. Oh, here's our oh, weed, by the way. Oh, dear. Ah, good evening, or uh, good afternoon, and good morning, he pretty much said. <laughs> Mr. Sunnyside's on the up and up. This this is our boss. Oh, my God, he's such a loser. Yeah, he is. Look at those glasses. Sunnyside. As Ratchet said, I am Commander Sunnyside. Everyone <laughs> Funnily enough, uh, there's actually an anime based on this, uh, too. This, yeah. Mm -hmm. Couple, like, yeah. two or three short little <laughs> anime episodes. Yeah. Yeah. An, an OVA, I believe the term is called. Uh, I wanted to get it at one point. There's a movie and an OVA series. The movie has nothing to do with this, though. But the OVA series is called Soccer Wars New York, New York. This is my chance to prove my dedication. Cool. What's the worst? I will devote my soul to you! Ah! 100%! I will devote my soul to you! I will lay down my life to protect the squad! <laughs> prove it! That was another good thing to say. Okay, cool. Told you, I played this game before. Bushido. Mmm. Chill, man. Fine. Anyway, would you like to try this marijuana cigarette? Uh, uh, we call it a phantom cigar. Because I swear, if you take Sunny and Otacon, put them together, you get this guy. You know that's weird. Entertainment. Actually, I actually really like that motto. To laugh is to live. Yeah, that's why we're comedians. Mm -hmm. So, technically, we're making people live. Hi, yes. Live, damn it. <laughs> Sweet. So, the village is pretty much where we, you know, our apartment. It's our apartment. Yeah. Ah, Harakiri. Ritualistic suicide, you know. What the fucking fuck? Okay. Oh, so I can't off myself? Nah, you probably shouldn't. <laughs> yeah, in America you live with your mistakes. I mean, look at our president. We got, we got to live with that for at least two more years. Yeah. Unless if he decides to commit Harakiri. <laughs> I don't think so. But I, I will say, if he does that live on television, there will be that'll be the most viewers ever. It, it, it'd be the bumper for every NBC thing. So, uh, we go ahead and save here. Oh, yeah, this is nice. So, conditions. Uh, there are our five teammates we haven't unlocked yet. We are a rookie because we, we literally just got off the boat. This is how we test as uh, we uh, see what our relationship is. All that. Okay. So, uh, we can also save here and all that stuff like that. Sounds fun, right? Sounds pretty fun. 
Well, well, it is fun. You'll see. You'll all see. If you have to work so hard to prove something, chances are it's not that good. <laughs> yeah. Uh, not gonna rumble, right? Oh yeah.